Hello, welcome back to Took's Crap Tables. How's everyone doing? I hope you all are well and welcome back. Welcome back to all my wonderful subscriber who's been here with me throughout and then welcome to my new subscriber i see i gained quite a bit lately and thank you today i am i have many new things to share <laughs> start with um welcoming my my new design team project brenda Yay! thank you so much for accepting my invitation and uh, i will link Brenda uh, video uh, channels below and she's already started making the tall journal and and she chose the uh, le chateau uh, blue the blue chateau <laughs> le blue chateau <laughs> i can't even remember my own kids because I have so many. If you don't know um, that I have Kofi page, please go follow me. Uh, the link will be down below. And yeah, so I'm so excited that uh, she she joined my team. And now I have quite a um, um, lovely team going. And uh, yeah, so and then I am having new kits and new item <laughs> will be in my shop so let's start with the uh, digital kit so we can get it out of the way and yeah please go and and, and go follow brenda because um i i you know what i try to to reach out people who have a different style of me that i can challenge myself and then see if if like the person would be interested in using in different style like render i'm having very mixed media and grunge and yeah very creative and so and me more like a cute sweet shabby <laughs> chic and classic and vintage kind of kind of so today i have three different style new kits <laughs> that i want to share so let's start with the whimsical uh springville <laughs> that's what i call it um it it it, it is a, a regular uh, journal a, a regular page journal and and um there will be two one is journal page and one will be the add-on and the the style is it's a whimsical so the journal page um you will get 18 again like um six design uh, could be the main page or front page or what whatever you would call it i call front page and then six moon muted um, color and light pattern so that you can write on you can print it on for the backing you can print on back for tag for envelope or you can print on the, the backing uh, for the journal page and then you get uh, another six collage page which you can tear apart or you could use as another page in the journal so that's what it is so it's in in total 18 so let's take a look at these isn't she cute very cute very cute so that's the full page and when you fold it you get these like that and then the back like that and then inside that is the inside page you could use for different page to backing that's up to you i just love this like you know like spring and you know you could make um a journal for your grandchildren you know this is like um really fun and cute and you know for spring oh we'll see this one but could it be yeah that's that was the uh, extra sorry it shouldn't be in, in there that's isn't that you i love her i i see this is me like 
<laughs> that's really me. <laughs> Uh, you know, when I when I pick out graphic or or images, <laughs> I'm, I'm always thinking of like who my friend would look like, or me when I'm all, or me me when I'm in a different mood. And take a look at the collage page. So this could be an extra journal page. Or it could be a tear apart page. That's up to you how you would use these. So, and uh, yeah. So in my Kofi, um, that there is uh, two type, no, three type of you to support my Kofi. First, to be my monthly supporter, which you have to click on monthly follower, and that. It will automatically deduct it uh, each month from your credit card or whatever you use to purchase that. And uh, it's I only ask for three dollars a month, and then you can access to my entire uh, coffee page. And uh, another one, if you don't want to be, if you just want to buy the kit that you you will use, um, so you could just go on and click on purchase that each individual and then um, you know and then you can give tips which won't give you access to anything but it's just like um, a tips to me and so I have um yeah some somebody pointed out to me that um, in, in on my page it suggests that if they pay more they will get access to more, which I think that was the default from Kofi, which is my not my message. So please, please don't um don't do uh, don't go and purchase anything like that and but before reach out to me if you don't understand the that kind of um a message, just reach out to me because I didn't know that it said because I think. The coffee is is kind of like a buy me coffee page, but then it turned out that a lot of artists had joined coffee because it's like a platform for art artists to to give back to their Patreon um, by sharing their work on coffee page, and then their supporter or they patronage would be going and support them there so that the idea of how Kofi page start and then it become the bigger platform so that we can sell or get a commission for our work and so on and that's why it it want to promote you in that way saying that you know you pay more you get more kind of thing but it doesn't really work with everyone <laughs> I mean you pay, you pay you pay less you get more on my coffee if you become a member <laughs> uh, so um here's the add-on i just thought it was cute so uh, i was just playing like you know how could i make the ephemera to be quirky and whimsical and i just like drawing and doing this and that, and that come out to be like this and then i thought it was fun fun belly band and and sorry for you know my my nail look at that oh it's disgusting Yesterday it was completely black and I bleach and I do so many times I wash my hand my finger it's still still not get it all out but I'll tell you the story in a bit. Let's take a look at these. So this is like a coin envelope and then you get like a different tag lots of tags and, and, and tear out um, images and stuff, right? And then envelope, so I make these long envelope, and it's and then you can cut out as window, or you can just glue some image. You don't want to cut out, you just glue image that which I would have um, over it, and then it will. And then you don't have to have a window envelope, or you could cut it out and make an envelope window envelope. But yes, because I was trying to print 
Oh, and then my Epson Eco Tank. It say that my waste bin is full, and then I have um, a couple weeks ago it said it's almost full, and so so I got a replacement. So the replacement, I didn't bother to replace it. Well, it said it's almost full, so I wait till it says it's full. <laughs> how how silly is that? So so I take it out and I replace it, and. It doesn't recognize the new one, and I look and I search and I search, and then Epson doesn't make it. This is like the fault that I am always behind Epson Eco Tank, and now I change my mind. If I have to buy a new printer, I will not go back to Epson Eco Tank because it's like they should have up update their software or firmware or something because my computer is registered um, my printer register online with them so they should have checked and then okay you know you reset i did reset i did youtube google and all those there's no no resolve from no way of fixing it not even to epson Except you have to take the printer into the Epson Center so they can reset it for you. And I tried to find a number to call the center and have nowhere I can find a number. So I create, so it said um, submit report or support. I create a ticket to their support center and it bounced back to, to you know, they have this questions that they just redirect you to the questions and answer and no way I can go to the support site so it's just going back to the question is this answer your question this is answer your question and I was so frustrated I was just like oh my goodness I, it was not a happy day and my husband he's like um I think I'm gonna go out <laughs> He's like, I never seen you being so furious. I was so mad. At one time I was crying. I'm like, you know, I just love the printer and there's nothing wrong with it. It's just this stupid little thing that you, when you take an old one out, you should be able to replace a new one. And then at one, one YouTuber said, okay, you take it out, you can take the, um, the filter that, collect the waste in right you can take it out and you can rinse it off and that's what I did <laughs> how stupid <laughs> oh so yeah that's a long story long long story so I and then I start okay I haven't used my laser printer because the cartridge the ink cartridge cartridge is like extremely expensive right i mean i bought the printer like 400 dollar printer and then there's i have to still buy the ink cartridge and each color is 80 dollars so i need four color to so i've been trying not to use it because like so expensive to buy uh, ink. Uh, so I haven't used it for a long time, and then when my eco tank is no longer happy, so I send the work to my laser printer, and it start feeding paper so fast. I'm like, what's going on? And then it just feed through like the whole paper that I put. I just literally just put in and then I print out all these these like unbelievable like probably hundreds of cheats like this is because I could not cancel the print I cannot cancel the job I cannot do anything even like I disconnected and it still keep printing I turn it off turn it back on and then it still keep printing. I'm like, what is going on? 
Oh, somebody jinxed me, I think, yesterday. <laughs> but I'm so sorry, whoever I was pissed off and, <laughs> and cursed me yesterday. I hope that's all. I already paid it. <laughs> anyway, so that's, and then at the, in the evening, like, when I more calm down, so I start to redo everything, restart, shut off the laser and now I got the laser printer to do and then I just couldn't waste the paper so I reprinted on this so this is gonna be the border like this oh my goodness so anyway so let's take a look at this cutie this is the journal card and this is pocket I mean it's pretty cool like you know if you could decode it <laughs> And here's a pocket. I have torn pocket. I have like funky pocket. And this is this is like you can fuzzy cut out character or you could tear out this card or whatever you would I just think about how you doodle with watercolor and black ink pen so i just thought i do that here but i doodle with images and you can still use as a cutout or you can use to decorate your page like that i just thought it's so fun and i i really like um laser because it's dark color bold and dark color so the image is more clear than um, than my inkjet so I just couldn't send through the laser all the time because it's like if if they make the ink so like cheap affordable like 20 bucks I would print more like this is like eight dollars and I need four of them to to fill the printer I don't know what I was thinking back then why I was thinking of print and ship my digital that was i was gonna offer in my shop print and ship um kit that's why i got the printer but then i didn't even bother to check out the price of the ink <laughs> oh, that's why i couldn't offer that option look at that This is pocket, corner pocket. I thought it was fun. Yeah, so that is the add-on to the, whims the Whimsical Springville. Okay, that's the bill. So next is my Easter, sweet Easter, because it's so sweet, this kit. I did a tall journal again. Uh, because I just love making torture no now. It go to phase. <laughs> go through phase. But um but I have to say the this is just like very blue and pink and yellow and purple and green. It's just so pastel, sweet and yeah, so it's just so fun. Oh snowdrop everywhere now and my iris and oh my um, flower is just peeking out so much and i hope that knock on wood no more snow <laughs> but you never know right you never know with nature one day is sweet one day is grumpy Just like us. This is so pretty. I don't know. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna be making journal for a while. I think because I just. I just have no room for it. I have a lot of journal left. Um, in the shelf here and. In my room, I just know where to to step 
<laughs> There's just so much stuff in here. And here's some the collage page. The collage page is really pretty and very useful. You know, I try not to like put stuff saying Easter, you know, because I want it to be a multi use for you like for all the time not just for easter but this these these are a little bit but um but this one the collage page that you see you can use it as any time and yes it's upside down but that's in the postcard itself and i thought it's pretty cool like you know when you found something defect it add value isn't it <laughs> like coin if you make mistake in coin so it make it rare <laughs> so that's it's really pretty very very spring like and yeah so again it's six of each three different use of paper and that is the journal page now I oh the add-on I have so much fun making the add-on and this one is a little extra I have the other one is 20 sheet my maximum is 20 sheet because I try to keep the file small because when the file is too large and when it get download or transfer sometimes it get corrupt midway and so I try not to do that but this one I just have so fun and I just couldn't pick what to keep so I keep them all <laughs> and this is the ATC size card and then you could make it decoration or make ephemera again my favorite belly band just love them love 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 and then like the tag or bookmark I usually use it as tuck. Good side. Good side to make the tuck. And then envelope. And then you can print the collage page on the back side. So that way you get your envelope. And then in this tag, pocket. Pocket and tag. And then you get general card. Very cute. And then you get a long tag that will go perfectly in the pocket that's coming up. Yeah, it'll go in, in here some pocket. So cute. Postcard. Postcard very, very pale pastel or muted. But this one, though. No. I love this one. The see the when you my print on the laser, it a little bit shiny. Yeah, and see the language. <laughs> Don't know what to say. Like you couldn't even see what error is that. Like I look it up and I couldn't find anything. So pretty. Oh, look, look at this tag. Love it. You can make it as a, like a dangling tag, the smaller one. You can make it like a hanging tag. And this pocket. I love making this pocket because it's so perfect for the tall tag. And this as well, like the corner tag. Yeah, so that is it. The add on to the East, sweet Easter. It's a lot. Like a, it's a huge kit. I mean, yeah. So and the third kit is in Bohemian style. I haven't done these um, Bohemian paper for a long time, so. I have to say that I love the collage paper on this kit quite a bit. And I love how 
um, these really turn out like it's not super super like bohemian or, or like you know I but I love this page it's just like oh so pretty I call it um one wandering beauty I think no yeah <laughs> see <laughs> wandering spirit that's what I call a wandering spirit because isn't that like I was gonna say free free spirit but I, I don't want the name to be cached by AI and then think that I am copywriting on something like I have to be really careful what the what the name and then uh, I remember last time I made the Bohemian kit if somebody find it it, uh, offensive because I use the word boho or something but I don't know people can find offended in anything in any way but <laughs> so I just trying to be more careful that's all I just love this page and that's the second page this is um not print back and forth but I just pair them together I print it separate but I just pair them just so that you know I get the idea and uh, yeah so so pretty isn't that the color just like mm -hmm. <laughs> I have a cover prepare for the for the boho journal so <sighs> we'll see my mood it's, now i'm into making purse like i'm having so much fun making purse and i'm going crazy crazy and that's the journal front and back here's the collage that i i think is just so pretty i mean i mostly you do like very pastel soft color but this is like very strong bold color collage and it's can use in many 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 way and it's not yummy oh look at that. look at that the crazy quilt oh so so pretty so i hope you my all all my followers on i mean uh, my supporter my monthly supporter i hope you don't miss out on these just like i know you want to support me and some not uh, not just want to pay without like downloading but this kid like you gotta get it <laughs> it could be like even the um present wrap like gift wrap you know or you, if you do collage this is to cover the boxes like i love covering a uh, wooden box with my paper my collage paper so yeah so those are the new kits in my shop and my coffee so hope you will check it out and now let's show you my new obsession i have been making purse i love purse and I, I made these last week it was just like you know I, I've been wanting to make these for the girl for Christmas for but then I just like didn't have time to do it and then I suddenly I'm just like try to go through stuff and try to organize my thing and I'm like oh I can't make like journal to use fast enough so I thought what can I do to make to use up fast enough of these fabric and, and stuff that I have and then I thought oh I'm gonna make a purse and it turned out to be really cute and um, yeah so I just need to do, do a few like like this I mean I, I don't know if I want to put this in my shop but if you are interested maybe it's just crooked a little bit like the um, 
what do you call the closure I mean it's very nice and very strong closure See? like I have to really pull like that and um, inside very nice inside um, really nice linen stripe linen inside and then I have these like, tiny in there and then the, and this one I mean you can you can have it like that or you can wear it fold in like this and this 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 is plastic so it's not heavy and it's not gonna hurt your your arm your arm or your shoulder you can go around your shoulder as well um, but I'm, I'm tiny though like if you're bigger than me may not go around your shoulder but what you can do you can get an extension if you have a, a, a sh uh, what do you call a shawl a scar you can tie it and then make it the extension to this and then make it a long long uh, strap and uh, yeah so it's a slow stitching I just add bits and pieces into these and then I made these um, honeycomb with the remnant that I have fabric that I have and nice crochet and then the back is kind of like um, I learned this from um, oh sorry don't mind my fingers <laughs> okay <laughs> what can I use <laughs> um, yeah so uh, I used I made this kind of like um Amity Bloom technique that she, that I learned from her class and then yeah beautiful fabric that I use and this is linen and picking and vintage button and, and then I have my this is my, my tag that I used to make clothes so I just attached to that and then the bottom is um, you know when I show three Paul I, I have this uh, sample of leather um, so I use that leather if you are against um, leather using this this may not <laughs> Be, but I I didn't kill the cow. I just went and got from thrift store. <laughs> so I thought, um, you know, uh, yeah. So and I had the foot feet have the feet and the and another uh, my uh, boo boo part is I didn't have um pressure foot for leather. So it's not uh. A straight stitch it's maybe a little bit wonky but you you probably don't see it like like that like you know it's not too obvious but when you see it, but then and in the in the uh, what do you call it? another one I'm gonna make more of these uh, in the future I'm I will be lining backing <coughs> of this with the um, fusible web so that it maybe it's stronger so that that will be in the future another one i mean so this i'm gonna try to put on the website on my website uh, if i get it done because i'm not gonna wait till like i got the collection because that way if you or if you interested in you can reach out to me and show interest and then and then I have this one the retro style this one uh, the fabric I got it um, from lovely Wendy thank you Wendy I finally use it the fabric that you sent me um, Wendy at um, uh, Journal Adventures and uh, yeah she sent me a a couple years ago she sent me a package and then one of these in there and then a, a tablecloth with this bright red embroidery 
roses and I just thought oh my goodness you know it just like so goes so well like I don't know I just thought it is and then the handle is rose coal oh I forgot to sh show the measurement this is um, eight and a half inches and the height is six and then the four and four and a half inches wide okay, uh, and six inches for the for the bottom and it, it has it has a feet as well and then in here it's a plastic that I put in um, a, a fold file folder plastic file folder in here that I use it and I have this beautiful golden brown um, tassel that hang on dangling here you can take it off because it's only attached with a, a lobster claw so you can take it on and off and inside I lined it with um, uh, similar to velvet velvety fabric. I don't I don't have a long strap. If you want a long strap, you you can get it yourself. So inside it's kind of like a velvety fabric here, and I put in handmade and the this. I also have a, a tag made by Took. Took's custom made, and then the pocket. In you have a two two side pocket here for your phone or your credit card. Yeah, so really pretty, really really nice clean edges and yeah so I just thought it would be like a fun summer you know I always want one of these you know um, purse to carry around but um, red it's just not my color if you like red <laughs> but uh, I did I just have it, it this is just my first one my first one just like I just drew the um, pattern uh, hand free like you know I don't have a rule or number that I go to or buy I just put down the handle and I just start drawing and measuring out and that's how it come out like this so I have um, what do you call I did redraw these so the next Next one, it's gonna be um, a little bit wider. Which I think, if it's come out a little bit wider here, it will look nicer. But this one's still nice. I mean, oh, it's so adorable. It's so cute. Like, and then it's the rose gold. Yeah, so it's so pretty. And I am working on another one, which is a completely different style that um this one is gonna be like the whole thing embroidered like oh this side it's already done for one side and this one I also like gonna be like that the tassel is so pretty and this one the handle is like this and this is a pretty large large side which I just got one of these because the because this is it's expensive eh, to get um, just the frame just one of these is like twenty dollars and I'm just like ah oh, I'm gonna try one and see what it look like but it's gonna be so pretty in the bottom I'm gonna use that leather to be the bottom so and then it open like that. It's gonna be pretty, I think, and yeah. So, but it's gonna be a while till I, I'm done this, and then I. This is what I'm talking about. Like I need to fusible for that 
purse, the first purse that I didn't do. And yeah, so this is in the progress. And and I have another one that I I I'm gonna I have to show because I think this is gonna be the coolest one. Um, this is the same handle as a, a the red one. Sorry, same size, same handle, but. Look at this. This I got it from. Um, oh, oh my goodness! I forgot it. Ah, um, on the live sale. Oh, her name will come. Um, I haven't been shopping with her for so long. That's why I forgot her name. But Pad, Patty, Patty Lang. Oh, so yes, I got these back. A coin bag from Patty Lang a while ago, and I thought it would be so so cool to to, to the purse gonna be look like. Okay. <laughs> oh my goodness! This this antique coin bag is gonna turn into a very funky and cool purse. And the other side, it's just gonna be plain, but I think I'm gonna do embroidery on it or a patchwork or yeah, it might be just a patchwork like uh, a rip style patchwork for the back kind of yeah. So I'm just trying to come up with something a way to use, but I still have to buy material to go with. So. That is how I'm going to be using up my stash. <laughs> but I'm making more stash. Just just so that because the you journal know, is just sitting there. So if I make it and if the bag doesn't sell, like, I can give it to the kid, you know. So <sighs> that's how my thinking going. And hopefully I will... Get these that one done, and then this is gonna be next, and then next, and next. Yeah, so that's in my pipeline. <laughs> so hope you are well and get ready and and enjoy the weekend. It' gonna be a rainy weekend for for us here, but hopefully no thunder, so the boy can can sleep. <laughs> so it's mommy and daddy. <laughs> <laughs> so have a wonderful weekend everyone and we'll see you very soon bye